brand new professional spring football league. Uh, the idea with it, although we're not positioning ourselves as a developmental league, in essence we are. I mean, what we're doing is we're taking these guys that are this close to playing at the NFL, we're bringing them out here. We've got a bunch of coaches that have years and years of experience, and, and these guys can coach them up and hopefully get them invited up to another NFL camp. Um, so with us, we're, our season will wrap up, which starts with camp, middle of February, and then the season will start at the beginning of April, run through the end of June. And so there's about a month before the NFL camps open up, and these guys can, the NFL's invited to come out and watch these guys. They see a player they like, number 22, and they track them along. They bring them up to their roster, and, and, and really it's, it is, it's really win, win, win. Uh, we win because we develop a player, and that's great. The players win because they now get to fulfill their dream. One, they're playing professional football with us, and then they get to go on to the NFL for you know, the, the, the bigger and better things. But it's also a win for the NFL because they get a developed player, and that's been a struggle right now is trying to get uh, coaches just don't have enough time to develop their starters, much less get into their depth and get them where they want them to be. So we'd have a guy that would come in into the NFL camp having spent a whole bunch of reps in practice, having had game time experience playing at game speed, and uh, I mean, they, they're ready to go. They're much more prepared than some of the, the guys coming out of college or someone who's been holding a clipboard for, for, for months or years. So tell us where we are right now and what's going on today. All right, so we are at the IMG Academy here in, in Bradenton. We kind of, they're, we've got a relationship with them. Uh, it's, it's a friendly relationship, obviously. We're, uh, our camps will not be here. Our training camp um, is going to be out at the Premier Sports Campus with, over in Lakewood Ranch, which is just right down this road, about you know 15 miles. Um, but here, what we're doing is this is kind of the first wave. The trial camps we're going and we're, we're looking at these players, looking at their talent, timing them on some some combine type drills in the 40s and the short shows and, and getting their measurements and measurements. And then we're uh, and then what we'll do after this this session, we'll go into where they'll split off with individual coaches again with this depth of experience they have. They'll get coached up by the coaches so those coaches can see what they need to. You know, are the hips moving the right way? And are they dropping, holding the ball long enough? Uh, and then we'll go into some one-on-one -on -one drills where the, where the offense will play against the defense a little bit. No, no contact, but again, to kind of give these coaches and our staff a good look at what the players have to offer so that they then will spend some time during December reviewing those, that film, and then in January we'll, we'll have the draft. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I, I wish I knew the exact timeline um, and, and in what sequence. I think kind of the, the, the idea of vision for us would be we identify a, a city, a venue, and, and we have kind of a joint press conference where we're announcing that we're playing there, we're playing in this venue, and here's the coach and the GM for that team. Uh, I think we may, we may go a little out of sequence and, and name who are. We have our coaches and GMs and, and a lot of the coaches already identified so we may start to announce that out ahead of the team cities but uh, you know this he'll be a GM he'll be a head coach and then once the team cities are announced then we kind of marry him up now uh, you know the fuse continues to burn and one thing that hasn't stopped in this whole thing is we're at inside of a hundred days till camp opens training camp so uh, a lot of things to get done but we've done a whole lot of things kind of 